really wants my ass. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm very happy to see you today. We're coming on into the third episode of our Let's Play Subnautica with mods. All right. Hey, today I got a bunch of surprises for you. We got a bunch of exploration to do. I made a new base, which look a lot better. I made some adjustment. I put a beacon. Also, somebody told me, uh, my PDA, for instance, has told me that I needed a self-scan. So we'll do that right away. Oh, and that's uh, that's about it. Let's go find what I uh, wanted to show you guys. Okay, cool. Here it is. I found that while collecting resources. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about, dude? Don't do that. Come on. What does it contain? Oh, what? Nice. <laughs> cool. Okay, I'll admit I'll never crafted it. So I never thought it was useful. But since I'm running kind of low on water and stuff, it's going to be good. And I got food too. Damn, that guy came in clutch. What did he say? Craig McGill here. I managed to accept the desert of planet 3716C by crafting a rocket from scavenged materials and scrap part of my craft ship. I survive on nutrient block and recycled water, if you know what I mean. <laughs> oh no. I'm on my way home now and I won't need this still suit anymore, so I'm donating it to space. May you find it useful. Sorry about the smell. <laughs> Holy hell. <laughs> nice. Well, that's, that's nice. He came from an another planet. And it fell right into ours. Well, that's that's kind of nice. And and I got free uh, a free material. All right, that was cool. I also crafted a propulsion cannon and a laser cutter, so now I can go into the aurora. And I think that's what we're gonna do today. I can also go into shipwreck like that and uh, open up the doors that are broken. Let's cut this up. Here we go. Oh. Laser cutter fragment. Are you for real, man? Oh, yeah! Modification station. What I find kind of weird is like, I open this up with a laser cutter and you give me a fragment of this and battery charger. I already have those. Which is weird. Alright, what's inside? Cannon fragment. I already... All, all of those. I got... Oh, oh. Uh, ah! What the hell? Okay, I did not know that that could air. Lightweight eye capacity thing. Maybe I move faster with it? Okay, so what's inside instead of going up, which kills me? I'm going down. Oh, I hate those noises. Damn, I hate those noises. Okay. Mobile bay, I already have what? Another laser cutter that I can't scan? Okay. Mobile, I already have that. Battery charger too. Well, it's a bunch of titanium. I, I won't say no. Oh, hell yeah, we got it. The last piece. The one and only last piece. Now I can modification. I can modification. I can modify everything. What's inside that? Vehicle upgrade console? Oh, nice. Maybe I need that for uh, the moon pool? I think so. Oh, that was a nice... That was a nice place, actually. All right, so we got a new massage. Okay, so he's clearly dead, sadly. He's clearly dead. Oh, that's where the electric ray are, right? Electric eel. Yeah, and if I remember correctly in episode two, there was a reaper there. There was a reaper there. So if I go that way, there's another reaper, right? Sure is. There's always a reaper. Oh. Or, or maybe a ghost leviathan. I don't want none of those. Oh, I got a new massage. Aurora, we're approaching oh no! Now. We have a landing site for you. That's well, it's better than the alternative. God damn it! I'm not ready for that. It'll take us a couple of days to align our. I had so much things to do. Establish direct contact with you during. I can't be rescued. We're coming in to get you. Cross your fingers. <laughs> I need to go to the Aurora first, and then I thought I would go there. Okay, I got a 40 minute marker now. Uh, I think I have time to do the full Aurora first, right? And I really hope that there's no new Leviathan from the mods, to be honest. I I really do. <laughs> uh, but it's completely dark now. I'm really a wuss, so I'm gonna wait until it's the day, right? All right. Okay, so here we go. The day's coming. Uh, we're not gonna waste any more time and we're gonna go to the Aurora. Simple as it is. I'm gonna go a little bit there, 
before going to the Aurora for the simple reason that I don't want to see our good friend the Reaper Leviathan. You know? Because that way, I could lead him to my house. Okay, so here we go. I already hear the Reaper. I'm gonna save because because I'm already hearing the Reaper. <laughs> We're gonna go as far as we can from him on the top of the water. We're gonna go right when we can and normally we should be fine right he wouldn't attack us right here yeah we're fine okay it's really the worst part <laughs> it's to go near ah calm down guys you're gonna get an autograph later jesus chrysler okay so yeah uh it's really the worst part when you hear him and you know he's there but you need to go there anyway yeah that's the worst part cool and it's still the day. Alright, so now we got to get into the Seamut. Follow the exact same step as before. So we don't see our beautiful Reaper friend. And uh, we're getting home. That's it. That's, that's, that's what we got to do. No. Thank you. I don't want any of your goddamn flyer. I'll be honest. He's not behind us, is he? Oh, that doesn't sound good at all. Okay, that sounds good. That sounds very, very good. Thank you. Excellent. <laughs> we made it out alive. The second roar, I'm pretty sure he latched onto me. And like, he was about to follow me, but then I went too far and he was like, yeah, let's forget it. Doesn't seem that good. It doesn't seem, it seems tro too crunchy, you know? I got a new massage. This is Life Pod 7. Oh, cool. Come on. I need diamond for the modification station. That's all I need. So we'll get that as soon as we go to the new place in seven minutes. Okay. Uh, I'm just going to get rid of all of this and we'll go. Cool. So we made it. Uh, of course, as usual, we're still hearing the Reaper around the goddamn mountain. <laughs> Which is kind of unfortunate because I hate them, huh? You know? So I got a bunch of things to scan, I got a bunch of resources to grab, and uh, we'll wait for the ship. We're gonna get rescued, guys. Hell yeah. Okay, so this guy is just floating around. Could you not? <laughs> Can you maybe leave me alone? <laughs> I would really appreciate it. Oh, damn. I was grabbing resources and he just teleported right in my face and started floating my way. That's rude, man. That's that's just rude. Okay, uh, back to it. Okay, he really wants my ass. I'm gonna leave you alone, buddy. But I really know that I really need those diamonds, man. Okay, so I was lucky enough to not get stabbed once again, but these warper are really freaking mean, man. Also, I saw around the island that there is a bunch of new creature from the- What are you doing? What are you doing? No. That's- that- you shouldn't- you shouldn't do that, man. That's- that's a big no. Yeah, what- what I was about to say is... The mods added a bunch of new creatures around the- the mountain. And, uh, some we saw in the episode 2, the long boy. But a new one. Like, kind of a uh, Half-Life 2 uh, big uh, big shark. You know the big shark with, like, two mandible? It looked like that, but bigger. So, yeah, I got scared and I went back on the island. And that's where the Warper tried to assassinate me once again. Okay. So, I got one more minute before they arrive. And one thing is for sure, it's dark as hell right now. Oh, what? Reclaim water? Oh, nice! That's how that works. Okay, it removes a little bit of food, which is unfortunate, but hey, we can't we can't have everything. Survivor, we see you. Man, I don't know how you held out down there. Where are you? We broke an atmosphere and we're descending towards the landing site. Nice. Is that a building down there? What do you mean you can't identify it? Hold on. No turning back now. Now you, you should turn back, actually. Never. This this building looks kind of mean. <laughs> Nine, eight. Yeah. Yeah. Change doors. Set thrusters to full. Ah. Shit. Wait. 
Well, we're stuck on this planet. <laughs> yup, we're stuck in this planet, that's for sure. God damn it. God damn it. Alright, fine, I'll explore the goddamn island. <laughs> Since we're stuck here anyway. Okay, so I found three purple tablets, and I'm gonna use one to enter this force field control. See, maybe if I can deactivate this big ass gun. Well, I don't know. And I found a bunch of diamonds and lithium, so honestly, we're fine. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna need more today. Dooby doo up, dooby doo wee. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. I really need those. Can I use them in the portal already? Like to go to to the other side? Already? I thought I had to like found it. No? Well that's nice. Why won't we use that in hurt? Oh yeah, that that that's that's grim, dude. Get me out of there! Get me out of there! Oh, can we see like the new new creatures from there? Like I told you guys, I, I found some creatures around the, the island. I don't know if, if maybe we can see them from here. Oh, that's the Reaper. And he is... Oh, that's, that's a Warper. I can't see too, too far, right? Yeah, well, yeah, I tried. <laughs> I tried to show you guys, but I'm not stupid. <laughs> I'm not stupid! Okay, there we go. Give that to me. Thank you. What's next? Oh. What? Okay, I thought that was like a pedestal for the cube. It would have been nice if we could have like chosen where we want to teleport once we have on lockdown. Instead of going to a place that teleports us to another place. You know, you have a big main control teleportation place and you just teleport from there where you want to go. I, I, I think for the late game purposes it would have been nice. Don't you think? It's probably a mod that does that. Just saying. <laughs> Energy core. Oh, I shot myself. Thank you. It's really helpful, to be honest. I just need food. The control panel is broadcasting a message. Translation reads... Warning, infected individuals may not disable the weapon. This planet is under quarantine. Oh. <laughs> Isn't it that great? If I scan myself, background broadcast, I am still infected. Self-scan complete. Bacterial infection in your system oh. is progressing. Detecting skin irritation and immune system response. I look fine. To yeah, I look fine. I, I really do. Boom! There's a big ass Leviathan right here waiting for us. That would have been that would have been nice, right? <laughs> anyway, guys, I think that's a good place to end this third episode. Uh, if you liked it, please like the video, leave a comment. That's really important for me, guys. I will respond to every comment. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss the next video. Uh, just a heads up, at 10,000 followers, I'll actually start live streaming anyway. So, that leaves us there, guys. I hope you have a beautiful day, and we'll see each other in the next video. Goodbye!